Which color comes to your mind when you think of plants? Is it green? That's true. This color is basically all about the functioning of plants. I guess you already know why photosynthesis is important. Without it, plants will die and so will the herbivores, followed by carnivores and omnivores. Plants are green in color due to the presence of green pigments in their cells. A leaf of a plant is composed of numerous cells. Each cell has various organelles suspended in its cytoplasm. One of the most abundant organelles in a plant cell is the chloroplast. The chloroplast is a type of plastid present in photosynthetic cells of plants. Plastids are specialized organelles that contain pigments or food. A chloroplast is a lens-shaped green plastid that is about 2 to 10 micrometers in diameter. A closer look at the chloroplast shows that it has an envelope consisting of two phospholipid membranes. The two membranes are separated by the intermembrane space. The space enclosed by the inner membrane is filled with a dense fluid called the stroma. The stroma contains enzymes of the dark reaction of photosynthesis, sugars, organic acids, ribosomes and chloroplast DNA. Within the stroma, stacks known as grana are present. The size of a granum ranges from 0.3 to 1.7 micrometers. Each granum consists of a stack of interconnected membrane-bound sacs called thylakoids. The thylakoid membrane is embedded with enzymes, electron carriers and chlorophyll pigments that are involved in light reactions. The grana are connected with each other by a network of membranous tubules called lamellae. Chloroplasts are the sites of photosynthesis. They absorb light energy that is used to prepare food. The cells of storage organs of plants contain another type of plastids called leucoplasts, which are colorless. They are of three types. Amyloplasts that store starch, elioplasts that store lipids, and proteinoplasts that store protein. The third category of plastids present in plants is that of chromoplasts. They are colored plastids that contain pigments like carotenoids. Chromoplasts are found in flowers and fruits and impart color to them. Plastids are specialized organelles that contain pigments or food. A chloroplast is a lens-shaped green plastid that is about 2 to 10 micrometers in diameter. The space enclosed by the inner membrane is filled with a dense fluid called the stroma. Within the stroma, stacks known as grana are present. The size of a granum ranges from 0.3 to 1.7 micrometers. Chloroplasts are the sites of photosynthesis. The cells of storage organs of plants contain another type of plastids called leucoplasts, which are colorless. They are of three types, a myeloplast, that store starch, elioplasts that store lipids, and proteinoplasts that store protein. The third category of plastids present in plants is that of chromoplasts. They are colored plastids that contain pigments like carotenoids. Ernst Haeckel was the person to discover plastids and use this term to describe them. Plastids are semi-autonomous organelles containing their own genetic material. There are other organelles than the nucleus that also contain their own genetic material. 